Okay then, here we are back at the eye. And the plan is the same. We have to climb up to the top, drop down, and try to kill the eye as we fall by. Here's open. Geronimo! Okay, I hit it, but I didn't kill it. So we gotta do it again. And again. Nope, still not good enough. This might take a little while. Yes, finally, dead. It only took 10 attacks in total by me and God knows how many by Cabal. Okay, in this room we have some green floating spike thingies and an ice dragon or two. This fight goes pretty well at first. But then it becomes clear that something has gone terribly wrong. Every now and then, you have those profound moments in video games where you discover something. This is it. Targeting. So yeah, targeting. Don't know how many times that could have saved my ass at this point, but there it is. Finally discovered. I hate these things, and all things that inflict poison damage. It's just ridiculously overpowered. Okay, here we are at the top of the ladder, dying from poison damage. Uh, we're in what appears to be a kitchen, but you know what? I don't think it matters, because I am going to die. Here goes Cabal, and there goes me. Yay! Okay, I've made it back up here. I don't want to go splat like Cabal just dead. Where's my- there's my healing potion. Ah, shit. Okay, I made it. Again. But I'm poisoned. Again. But at least this time I've made it to the save point so I can skip that crap again. Did I ever tell you how much I hate poison? Okay, this must be the kitchen, right? Precisely. It looks like the fact it's nighttime did us a favor. We haven't been found out by anyone yet. Really, the save point was the highlight of being up here. Moving on. Okay, found us a fake wall. Which leads us to another save point. Somewhat useful. So okay, the other side is a fake wall too, and I died again, awesome. Okay, let's light this up so we can see what we have here, one, two, probably, yep, three, and at least two bombers, this should be fun. Screw it. I'm gonna die from poison anyway. Well, I'm not really sure how that worked, but I'm alive, and Cabal's the one on fire. Let's see if I can get lucky twice. <laughs> nope. Before you lies an invoker. Boss time. Bruce Springsteen appears. Okay, so I steal his guitar and sell it on eBay. When you try to sell it, the key from your keyboard shoots out and lodges itself in your throat. You choke to death. Awesome DM. It's a sewer dweller, and the beast is stuck to the ceiling. It has tentacles, that can't be good. Uh, I can't directly aim at it with my bow, which actually sucks.
And that's the trick to this boss fight. You have to aim your ranged attacks at him without being able to lock onto him. Not the easiest. Alcantaras? I have no idea. I'm sure I'm saying it wrong. But that's what it looks like. Isn't it pretty? I can say, in pure honesty, I hate this thing. I have no idea how many times it killed me. I'm sure I'll find out before this video is over. But, uh, yeah. He's a prick. He's really only got a few attacks, but, uh... They're just annoying. It takes up the whole screen, eventually. You can release bats, frogs, and pipe bomb ratmen. Anyway, enjoy this highlight reel, more or less, of our utter incompetence with this boss fight. Did I forget to mention that the bats do poison damage? Fail. Fail. Oh jeez, this is awful. <laughs> oh hell, I'm trapped. After, like, two or three deaths and half a dozen failed jumps, we got an idea for me. You can see it. Look! Lock on! However, I think it would be like another four deaths before I figure out how to use this. <laughs> okay, now you guys can see the plan. You gotta lock onto something behind the boss. So you're shooting because he's, well, in the way. I really don't know why it's so hard to get on this ladder. Awesome. I'm on fire. Finally starting to get the hang of this. Got the barrel down below, locked onto it. So long as there's a barrel, I can shoot the guy. I hate poison so much. It's so overpowered. I should have stayed on that ladder. Oh man, I'm so screwed. I just... Bah. Man, I got a feeling I just can't win. Well, that's what I get for trying to help Cabal. Poison or explosion? What would you choose? Okay, you've seen it kick our ass. Now, it's time for us to do the ass kicking. That's the secret right there. Triple shot. A level 4 archery skill. Of course, Cabal's pyrotechnics there is uh, helping out quite a bit too. We have beat this guy before without all these fancy tricks. I just forgot to record it, so whoopsie. And there. It's dead. And I got like 4,000 XP for it. I love it. Okay, upon its death, a second ladder appears, allowing us to go upstairs. Nothing much here but a bunch of bats. Pretty easy to take care of. Of course, there's some more platforming. Finally, the top. What do we have? A door that's locked, and I have no idea how to open it. Got ourselves a fake wall. Up the ladder. Really just not a whole lot to see at the moment.
Okay, one more ladder and it looks like we're there. No, oh, looks like there's another ladder. But yeah, this is it. This is the mage's quarters. Make sure you pick up your key. You find the mage's quarters. You see magic books, essences, and even some mage clothing. We made it. Ha, huh, they'll never know it was us. No, of course not. You show up asking for the sort the same night all this shit goes missing, they'll never suspect it was you. That's a good point, and on that note, I think it's time we grab everything that isn't nailed down and leave. One last thing of note. There's boxes on the upper level, Cabal just got it. One gives you a cat, and the other gives you a... Dolphin. Make sure to pick those up, as you need those for trading at the merchants for new spells. Alrighty. Thanks for watching the show. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and I'll catch you on the next episode of Headcrab Entertainment.